Hello, I'm Lelda Smiths for the Finance News Network and joining me from HealthScope is its CEO and Managing Director, Robert Cook. Robert, welcome to FNN. Thanks very much. I look forward to talking to you. Now, HealthScope has just this week returned to public ownership and listed on the Australian Securities Exchange. What does this new chapter represent for the company? Look, the the exit event was really about recognition of the growth potential um, and the quality of the assets uh, that HealthScope has and hopefully also um, you know, recognition of the management, the quality of the management team and our ability to deliver on those strategies going forward. Right, and uh, HealthScope stock did rise 5% on debut. What do you believe investors find most appealing about the company? So we are defensive and obviously very defensive. Even in a GFC, people still you know, used our services. Our volume didn't dip. Um, and also, I think it's just sort of dawned on everyone that, you know, the ageing, the demographics, the technology, you know, everything about the industry just means that there is a growth rate um, that, you know, is, is, is not attainable in a lot of other injury, uh, industries. So you have the best of both worlds. You've got good steady growth, you know, combined with, you know, good defensive characteristics. Certainly. And Robert, what's your strategy to continue building on this appeal and, and growing the business? Look, the strategy for growing the business revolves uh, around uh, three things. Uh, first of all is delivering on the, the brownfields uh, and the relocate and grow projects, which are well documented, particularly at Gold Coast Private, um, National Capital, Norwest Private Hospital and Knox. So that's adding uh, capacity. We have responded to a number of government uh, state government tender opportunities, particularly the northern beaches in New South Wales, which is for a, um, a, a more or less a privatisation uh, model of a, of a public hospital up there. And the last one is we are working with health funds to confirm that we have uh, more appeal because we <clears throat> are providing a very cost-effective and most importantly quality service and we also um, publish our quality data. So we were the first to do that and we're a long way ahead of the rest of the field in that initiative. And now prior to HealthScope delisting from the ASX in 2010, the company was near parity with rival private hospital operator Ramsey Healthcare. How are you now positioned to battle the competition in the healthcare sector? Look, we actually compete for patients with primarily uh, not-for-profit, which represents not-for-profit hospitals, which represents over you know 50% of the industry. Obviously, public hospitals see private patients and day surgery see private patients. So in a, in a competitive market sense, uh, we don't actually compete with Ramsey uh, you know, across the board. There are local markets where it's fiercely competitive, but you know across the board we compete with the not-for-profit, day surgeries and, and public. In terms of market perception, you know, I'm really not going to comment. I think you know, the market will make its own uh, judgment about... You know, I think Ramsey's a really good company. You know, I've said that from day one, but I think there's space uh, in the market for there to be two really good companies. Finally, Robert, how much will you spend on expanding your hospital offering and where will the funds be injected? Look, the, the structure that we've gone out with um, as part of the IPO sees us with um, you know, a 300 million odd facility um, and the Gold Coast um, project is already separately uh, funding in a, in a separate vehicle. So we do have enough firepower. We, you know, we were anticipating spending over $600 million in the next uh, three years um, to put on you know, 653 additional beds. Um, so we've, we've got enough firepower to do what we want to do and we've articulated those plans to the market. Right. Well, Robert Cook, congratulations again on HealthScope's debut on the ASX. Yeah, thank you for that. It's been an exciting time for the company and um, thank you for the interview.